as we meet this young genius with such an amazing gift and learn how she does it and how she changes the lives of all who have come in contact with her. One day I had a dream of meeting God, but I was not quite sure. I had never met God and never been told about God. It was very confusing because at that time I was an atheist. But her talk was intelligent. Every time she would talk about God and the details of her life in heaven, how she described it, it was, in, it was very, very sophisticated. And I knew that at that time, nobody else could have influenced her in that way because we led a closed life. As time went on, uh, we paid more attention to it and then she uh, uh, it developed into painting and then poetry the angel has like faith and hope still and they have power from God they're angels they're guardians for us I wanted to show how the angels protect us how angels just show us where to lead show us where to go and even difficult paths. When I started doing all these details, it's like, well, how did that happen? How did God give me the, these ideas? And he gives me those ideas through my visions and dreams at night or when I'm walking, when I'm reading, or anything I do. So when I started having those, I said, I need to do something. I have a, a mission to complete in life. I wanted to express the beauty and the suffering of the black race. When I was painting her eyes, you could see her whole, whole life in her eyes. You could see how, she, how much she provided in her family and how she believed in God with hope. And I painted Jesus when he's in the Garden of Gethsemane. And he's raising the world to his Father and saying, forgive them. And I, I wanted to paint him because he's, he's everything that I am. He's everything that I want, I want to be and everything 